Hey everyone, I'm just going to play some games in this bullet arena. I think I'm 15 minutes late, actually. Um, so there's players who already got four out of four. So anyway, we're playing quite a strong player now, 1900 rated. We've gone for this weird system with have played B4. Uh, so I'm just going to gather up the white squares with E6 here. I'm not sure what the bishop on B2 is doing exactly. Now I'm, I'm contemplating B5 already. Maybe knight D7 first. And I'll take the knight off. I'm debating whether to play B5 because he plays A4. Uh, maybe knight E7 first. I don't want to play C4 though, that's the only problem. Yes, we plays A4 now. I could play B5. I could also play C5 actually. Because his bishop's pinned on b2. Decisions, decisions. I know, a5 first, followed by c5. Okay, I'll just castle, and we're fine. I really want to get a knight into c4 though. So if I take this, I don't believe this position for him or her. Maybe I'm just helping them with c5, but I'm not sure. Okay, so we can't capture. Or we could capture it and trade pieces. But I think I'm doing okay. I'm also quite low on time, actually, as well. So, Rook, maybe each knights are here. Now then, I'll play Rook here. I do have to be a bit careful. Maybe I've already blundered this position actually. So I'm just gonna double Rooks on the C file. I, feel, I think that's okay. Okay, they want to trade even more. That's fine by me, I think. Do I take this? Yeah, let's just take. Now then, if I play Knight here, followed by Bishop F8, and just swap everything. Maybe he's going to check. I hope so, because then I can swap Queens. But no. Knight here, protect everything. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'll play here. And I've got Queen C eight. No, Queen C1, sorry. With check, perhaps. Um, do I get my king? Let's unpin the knight. Um, okay, let's be quite aggressive. Let's play this. I think if they start trying to attack me... Okay, I've got to check. Now then, let's see if we can just win this endgame. So if it takes... Okay, looks like we're going to swap pawns off. This is probably a draw. I don't lose on time. Ok, 
Okay, there should be a draw now. Yes, that was a draw. Okay, decent start. Struck quite a strong player. I think if I get into the top 10, so as we see here, it's 1 and 5 out of 5 already, which is surprisingly strong for a, a 1000 rated player. Okay, so again, we're against a strong player, 1877. Okay, so they're going to play the carrot can. I'm going to play this variation. Um, let's go here. So I once played queen d6 before. Oh, maybe. So if queen d6, maybe I can go queen to g4. Oh, yeah, that's the idea, isn't it? Um, if I play queen g4, I'm fronting mate. Oh, he's got check. Don't be silly. Okay, let's just play d4. So I've won the white squared bishop, which is a nice victory to have. Let's just play bishop e3. Play queen e2, and we'll see which way we want to castle. Queen e2. I play c3. I don't want to get comfortable on either side of the board. Uh, Castling either side is good for me, really. I want to drop it here. Yeah, let's drop it here and we can play b4, maybe. Ah, so they're casting this side. Okay, let's just attack. Hmm, do I play b4? b4, b5. Let's play... Oh, the a pawn. Here. Do we have sacrifices here? Okay, we'll take that because it's annoying. Now then, do I have a sacrifice? I feel like bishop takes a6 is good. Bishop takes pawn takes queen takes queen c7 b5. Do you know what? Let's just do it. Maybe it doesn't work due to... I don't think it works. The rooks aren't connected, actually. That's pretty a bad decision. In this pawn up though, is this good? Check, no. Alright, but I am threatening c4 here. And I'd be very scared as black to take that a pawn.
I'm probably not going to be fast enough. Not fast enough. Damn. I think I was winning that game as well. Okay. So we're going to play... Let's play a little system here. Um, I'm just going to dominate the white squares. Pin that knight. Capture and play six. Solid position again. Yeah, I do like playing these solid positions. Uh, bishop e7, maybe knight to f5. It's nice. So he's going to. He's captured there, but I'm threatening to take on d4 now. And maybe play rook c8. So yes, yeah, so he goes backwards. I'll play rook c8, deter him from casting queenside. Play this, and hopefully he takes. So. The point is, there's no attack for white on this side of the board. And I'm just going to open, play rook uh, g1, g8 and open the g file. And I don't need to castle, so it's fine. Okay, let's just play rook here. Okay, so they're going in for like a really boring game here. They're going to try and trade everything. I'm going to take one pair of rooks off and play queen d7, attack this pawn, so they defended it, and they just need to be a bit careful now due to the rook on that file, and yeah it's not easy this actually, maybe f6, no he's got check, just knight c6 then, I don't want him to have that open file. Quite nasty if I took the bishop due to knight f6 check. Maybe I'll play. Oh, I can't play king f8 either. Maybe I should just launch the king this side of the board and it's protected then. Might just do that. And just, so that's going to take five moves. I think that's a good plan actually. Yeah, so if I just go here, and then I go here, oh, he's going to. Okay, so I've got to take that. Maybe I'll just play rook g6. I'm just going to take it with the queen. Yeah, that doesn't bother me too much, to be honest. Okay, so now knight here. I feel like the knight might be better in this end game. I play. Has he just lost a pawn?
Yeah, he might play queen b8. Oh, queen g8, sorry, check. No, he's not going to do it. So, I just play knight here then. So he's found a decent position. What should I be doing? Oh, that wasn't a great move. Nice attack. I think I was winning though. Tough game. Probably need to play something more attacking if I'm going to get the top 10. So 1500 this time. Um, D6. Oh yeah, I play bishop e6. Yeah, this is the line variation. It's quite nice. So the point is that black's really struggling. Oh, sorry, white's really struggling just to attack black here. Where does black? Where does um? How does white infiltrate black's position here? There's just no way. If I play b6, bishop e7, maybe rook d8. Yes, yeah, so bishop e7. Rook here. How does white continue? I used to play this in quite a lot of classical games. It's quite quite a good defensive opening. If the bishop captures a knight, I might just take it. Okay. Um. Yeah, so he's going to target this pawn, which is the right thing to do. There was supposed to be a way to defend this. Um, I'm not sure how sound this is. I think I've misplayed this slightly. I think if I just play king to c8 should be fine because I can play like knight g6 and captures, captures, captures and if he takes here oh that's an interesting move okay The problem with this though is I'm not going to capture twice, so I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I could capture. Ok, 
Okay, let's just play knight here. So I'm protecting this pawn twice again. I'll play knight to f4 as well. He's playing quite well actually for a 1500, I'll give him that. He could play knight to d4 here. Because the pawn's pinned, so that would be quite a nice move. And he could attack e6. Probably be forced to play rook to. Oh, damn, that's actually a really good move. He should have he should missed that. Okay, so he wants me to take this pawn, but I'm actually playing knight here. Now then, where do I want to play? I think I might play knight to e5 if possible and just trade everything. Oh, I could play it now actually. Knight e5. Takes, takes. Oh, he's got. Let's just do it. Yeah, that was a nice finisher. He's lost on time, but I think they had that just about under control. That was quite a hard game. People are playing well. So I'm playing another player, 1500 from Bangladesh. I'll play the Vienna this time. Um, okay, F4. Attack this e5 pawn. How are we doing? We're nowhere near the top 10. But we can just enjoy the chess. Okay, so I'm getting a decent attack. If he plays a5, I play a4. He plays pre b4, knight d1. Now then, do I want him to take this bishop? No, I play here. If bishop e6, knight to e3. And this guy's actually ranked fifth in the tournament at the moment. Six and a half out of seven, so he's a strong player, even though he's a 1500 rated. Okay. Ah. If I play queen here, I'm attacking this pawn twice. Maybe that's what he was worried about. Could I have taken that pawn before? Wait, what? I could have taken it before, that's stupid. Okay. Now I've got to be very careful now. Stupid. That was bad. Um, okay. Let's try and take this bishop off. I could play bishop e3. If he plays bishop c5. Okay, we'll play bishop e3. Hmm. So 
So I come with a pawn, I take on here. No, I can't, it's very risky. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to take here and play queen to, yeah, queen to g3. He's got check actually. Um, safety first. Yeah, mis totally misplayed this game, but I think white's in a superior position with these two doubled e pawns. Yeah, I wish you'd just leave me alone. I'm trying to play queen here. No, that's terrible. Okay, I've totally misplayed this. Yeah. Let's try and win on time. Still not so easy for black because they've got so terrible pawn structure. I've got to be a bit careful. I want to play knight here, but then he's got rook. Actually, that doesn't work, does it? No, it doesn't. I can play rook again, yeah, knight here. Knights are very tricky. I'm throwing knight here, check. Yes, yeah, so he's moved uh, knight here. So I've got a pawn, so I'm going to take either this pawn or this pawn. Or maybe not, actually, because he can... Oh, no, it just... No. It depends where he moves. Um, yeah. If I take here, though, I don't want to lose... I'm just going to play this. Don't want to give him any open files, so I'm just going to play here. Hmm. Uh oh. Okay, I think uh, I'm going to win this on time. Okay, don't know why I did that. Mm. To be honest, I quite like my position there because the rook wasn't very good compared to the knight. Um, yeah, dodgy one. A weird game. But for some reason, he was quite a powerful player. He was on. He was the fifth player, and now we're playing the third rated. And this guy is only 2087. I feel like he's on 8 out of 10. So that's quite strong. Which is quite worrying. Um, yeah, knight here. Castle, maybe a4. Oh, good. No, never mind. Um, play here, bishop b2, knight d2. Should be fine. Yeah, I quite like this position, actually. Okay, we've got a decent position. Uh, don't want any of these threats coming up. Knight c4 is coming. 
can I play? Oh, is it attacking my pawn? We'll do it this way. Knight c4 coming in next. Actually, it stops knight g4 ideas as well. Oh. Okay, let's do it this. Attack that. It'd be quite nice to take his bishop off, actually, because that's his best piece. And it stops. Oh. Knight takes, takes. Oh, we can play a five. That's annoying. Oh, I could have played knight to b6 as well. Oh. Okay, so I am threatening knight takes bishop actually. Um, okay. Yeah, it should give me a free piece. Okay, so you have too many threats. That was quite a good game. Player 2042 from Azerbaijan. He's great. Uh, he's 54th in the tournament. To be honest, the way we've been playing has not been great, so I don't hold much hope in this game. this opening. If I take, play queen f2. Wow. g4 takes, takes, like g4, captures, captures, captures. Uh, I've got to be worried about this knight move. Maybe bishops can pin it. Oh yeah, I can just do that. So he's given up a piece for two pawns. Very brave of him. But does it work? Um, bishop here, check. Rook takes. I've got to be a bit careful. All right, king. Yeah, king up. I'm just gonna take this knight off, it's too dangerous. He's got the two bishops though, nice attack. So what does he play? Maybe f5? Open everything up? No, too risky. I'm just play f5 after I do that. Um, This is tricky. Bishop rook takes bishop. Hold on, if queen here, I'm attacking the bishop and then I just play queen to h2. How is he defending this? Oh yeah, it just takes, takes there. Knight takes.
So what's going on? Three pawns. I've got four pawns. He's got six. And he's also probably got a better position. But if I can get my rook king to c2. Problem is he's got his d5 pawns really strong, it's stopping my play. Oh maybe bishop e3. And if d5 sorry, bishop e3. Hmm. Damn, that's annoying. That's a good move. Um, no, I can't do that. going one on time close game oh my god I think he definitely may have misplayed that I think I certainly did as well okay so we've got maybe enough time for one more game if I hurry four minutes left on the clock I need to sprint okay so he's played bishop e6 I'm going to play bishop b5 oh he's going to fold the bishop around and play f4 uh, okay now I can play bishop c4 go back Castle, maybe take on e5 next move. Um, yeah. Oh god. Okay, I'll take this knight off. Knight here. Um, Um, yeah, he can play b6, so I'll just play king here. Three minutes left. Mm, let's play, yeah, let's play here. If he takes on b2, I'm more than happy for him to have that pawn. Uh, oh, damn it. Attacking a lot of pieces. Check, check. Yeah, I should be able to win this game in time. Uh, 
It's gonna be close though, I don't know what he could play. I'm attacking the bishop. Takes by queen c6. Look there. And then just take everything. He's just gonna time me here, I don't know. Potentially. Okay. Check. Check. Make next move. Okay, cool. One more? I don't think so, but where do we come then? 21st. Unless we can get a quick win. 21st? No, I don't think so. Let's just do this. Uh, here. Let's not get mated. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, we've got a minute left, so I doubt any of us are going to win this game. Uh, take this. Now this is kind of alpha zero -y, isn't it? We've sacrificed a piece. I feel like if we actually continued this game, we might actually get a mate, which is quite hilarious. Queen b6 maybe from him. Oh, I feel like we would have won this game. Just because, yes, yeah, so here. Just because now we're going to play Queen H4 check and stuff like that. Yeah, play Rook here. Oh, this would have been so nice. This would have been a good game. Yeah, but I can play Queen here. Damn. We've only had enough time to finish. What an interesting game. But anyway, so we came late. How did we do? I can't remember. So we got six and a half out of eight. Pretty decent score. 23rd out of 474 players. Nice. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this chess commentary. Sorry, I didn't speak a lot. I was just literally trying to concentrate on the game because it was so hard. But anyway, see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys.